Hello everyone and welcome back to another American Truck Simulator video. Today we're going to be doing another job in Colorado. I believe we're going to be heading out to Fort Collins. Uh, pretty long drive, but it should, should be good. Uh, just got to wait to get out of here. Is red going that way too? I think so. See if I can squeeze around him. Right, there we go. So we got just about a mile to go here to our pickup spot, and then we're going to pick up our cargo. Good on gas, good on rest. Uh, we should be good. Truck is still slightly damaged, so I'm, if I get away in, I'm probably going to get fined again for that. Again, yeah, we're in Lamar, Colorado right now, so it looks like we're going to be going from Lamar to Fort Collins, at least the job I selected uh, said that. It might change by the time I get there, though. Looks like it's about 6 a.m. right now. And this will take another um, city off of the list here if I do the Fort Collins job. I haven't been to Fort Collins yet in the game. Let this guy pass. I see it. Alright. All right, let's check freight market. Fort Collins, or we can do Colorado Springs. We'll do the Fort Collins one because we haven't been there yet. Right, there's our trailer. Looks like it's a at least a double, might be more. Looks like getting in here could be could be tricky. Might just have to drive off of that media there. Or we're going to have to come at it from this way. Probably not enough of a turn there. Let's pull up a little bit more. Alright, that should be good. See how I'm supposed to actually get out of here now. It looks like I'm supposed to swing around that way, so we'll, we'll try that. It looks like it's a triple trailer. Let's see. One, two, yep, three, three trailers. Guess I can't get out this way, maybe? Doesn't look back into the road. Unless I can cut through here. Nope. Or go out. Yeah, we'll go out this way. 
What do we got here? 300 miles to go. I'm hung up. Alright. Damage to the trailer there. 1% so it isn't too bad. to arrive around 11 a.m. Clear to turn. Kind of hung up there. I think we're good now. Hopefully we get a lot of time on like the uh, highway so we can at least uh, try to shave some of this time off. Considering I'm hauling three trailers, so it's pretty heavy. So yeah, this is probably going to be a fairly long drive if we're, um, you know, carrying this much weight. We're probably not going to be able to get up to our maximum speed. So that could take a little while. Alright, this goes up to 50 now. You can bypass the way station, all right. So we're at 43 right now. We can go up to 50. We got the bypass service going on there. Still fairly early in the morning. Let's think about 618. Oh, I'm up. Now it's up, up to 65 now, which is good. Interesting when I took this job, it didn't give me the little warning about the um, make sure your truck is like up to speed or up to snuff to haul this much stuff. So 
So we're up to 61 now. We're, we can go up to 75 if we can get there. Let's check here. All right, so we're making pretty good speed, considering how much we're hauling. Take you to look at the sun coming up over the east there. I'm hoping when I get to Fort Collins on the next time I do a delivery, I can get a job that goes out to maybe uh, Grand Junction or somewhere like in that area. Because there's an achievement in the game for, uh, let's slow down here. No, it's only 50 miles an hour. Um, there's an achievement for going through both directions on the Eisenhower Tunnel. I don't know if you have to be hauling cargo, because we've already been through the tunnel going um, east. We now need to, need to go through the tunnel going west. All right, now we need to slow down to 30. Slow down just a little bit more. Speed limit is still 30, alright. We're back up to 45. Alright, 247 miles left. Speeding violation there. I mean, I was trying to slow down, but... I mean, it's, it's, it's interesting how you get a speeding violation right when the speed limit changes. That doesn't seem like it'd be very realistic, but... What do we got here? 35 miles an hour through here? All right. Uh, there's one of the uh, inflatable flailing arm tube bed things. I don't think I've seen those in the game yet. What was it? The wacky waving inflatable arm tube bed or something? There's that family guy bit from several years ago. Alright, back up to 45. over there doing something. Like a, like a UPS truck at a church, looks like. Alright, there we are. We can go back up to 65.
got here. About 200 miles to go. It looks like 198 miles left. A little less than halfway there, so once we hit the 150 mark, we'll be about halfway. I-70 above there? I'm not sure exactly. What do you got here? Delta 45, let's slow down. It's supposed to turn, I think, right here. Alright, we're gonna get on I-70 now. So yeah, it looks like that that is I-70 above it. And I-70 is what, 75 miles an hour? definitely weigh in here so interested to see how much this weighs but then I'm gonna take a take a penalty for the damage again probably $500 there. 108,000 pounds, alright. I think I've had, had deliveries that were a similar weight. Exit lane? I think I'm in an exit, so let's... There we go. Alright, back on I-70 after the weigh-in. Definitely need to find the spot in one of these towns where I deliver to to get the truck repair, so I don't take that penalty every time I get weighed in. About the 150 mile mark, so we're about halfway there now. Total drive distance when I started was about 300 miles. Again, heading up to Fort Collins from Lamar. So, again, this will let me check off delivering to Fort Collins from that achievement or for visiting all the cities in the, in the state or all the cities that are in the game at least. Like I said earlier, I'm really hoping to get some more um, jobs that bring me west. So I have, I've only been through that area once when I was coming out this way. So hopefully we get to see like Glenwood Canyon again and like the Fort Collins, uh, not Fort Collins, uh, Grand Junction again and places like that.
think we're coming through Denver now, or we're closer to the close to Denver, I think. Just saw uh, sign for the Denver International Denver International Airport. So we're close to there. And, and Denver International Airport is actually somewhat far away from Denver, but it's, it's still in, the, in, in that general area. Ninety-two miles to go. Gonna be passing my, my garage here pretty soon. Yeah, there it is, right off to the left there, right in front of the dog food factory. Most of the time, when I've gone past that, I've been going the other direction, usually not this direction past it. Right, we gotta kind of start to get off here, it looks like. Head to I 25 now. got left. 66 miles to go. Oh, I need to get in the right lane here. There we are. I could probably turn my lights off. Let's say it's 11 o'clock in the morning. I'm probably pretty good on lights. All right, back up to 65. Now up to 75, all right. I don't know what that noise is. Whenever I drive around under, under like an overpass, it makes that kind of weird noise. I haven't noticed that before. down just a little bit here. Yeah, there it goes, there it goes again. Maybe it's the sound of the engine like reverberating off of the tunnel or something like that. Another way in, alright. Where is the state? Is it this? get fined again here. That's interesting. I've been through, I've been past three different way stations so far. Or this is the third. I've been forced to stop at two of them, and then I first one I was able to bypass. $500 thing, 108,000 pounds. Yeah, definitely need to get the uh, truck repaired. Let's see, we 
We've got to turn up there. we got 15 miles to go. It's probably where we're getting off, right? This is Fort Collins? Oh, no, no, no. I'm not supposed to get off here. I thought that was it. But no, it looks like we got to turn just ahead here. Take this, handle this uh, kind of crazy turn here. There we go. I see the drop off point now. It's right there. So there's Fort Collins, and I'll be able to discovering that town here pretty soon. So what will that bring me up to? So that brings me up to Glenwood, or Glenwood Springs. Um, Grand Junction, Denver. Was it Sterling? Sterling, Pueblo, Lamar, and then Fort Collins, I think. That's some slight damage there. Final mile here. close enough to Fort Collins to actually consider it to be discovered yet? I might have to drive around a little bit after that and see if I can find where the actual, like, trigger point is. But yeah, here we are. We've got our cargo here. that or should I yeah I'll do that just straight ahead pretty much it might be tough to line up because there is a three trailer so hopefully we can we can get this and get that ex the extra experience points Couple the trailer. All right, there we go. Excellent delivery. Uh, Two hundred ninety-eight miles total. Six hours, nineteen minutes taken. Forty-six point eight gallons of fuel. Nine thousand twelve dollars plus four hundred eighty experience. Um, One thousand seven hundred sixty-six dollar bonus with a long-distance delivery bonus of four hundred twenty dollars. So eleven thousand one hundred ninety-eight dollars and six hundred twenty-five experience. It's pretty good. See if there's a repair shop anywhere near. There's a job there. All right, cool. Let's set our set to go there for the repairs. And like I said, I don't think I've triggered the actual thing where I've actually discovered Lamar or discovered uh, Fort Collins yet. Okay, this is not a good spot to be parked. All right, we should be good. We should be should be clear. Engine malfunction. Yeah, that's why we're headed to get the truck fixed.
there's another garage we can purchase. I think having just the one in Denver is good. It's central enough to pretty much everything I need to do. Gas is good. Arrest is probably okay at them for the moment. Is that an Oscar Mayer? Looks like the Oscar Mayer hot dog car there, maybe? Or some kind of hot dog. Not sure what it is. Where's that train coming at? So I think on the way to that repair shop, I'll be able to... Oh, just ran a light. All right, great. I'll probably trigger Fort Collins being discovered pretty soon here. Yeah, I'm not seeing the little pop-up notification saying that I discovered Fort Collins, but I should have obviously triggered it by now. Right, here's another speeding violation. Agency, I don't really use. But let's go ahead and do some repairs here. It's going to cost uh, three thousand, um, three thousand five hundred dollars, maybe. Yeah. Cool. Truck is repaired. And that is going to do it for this drive here. We'll be back next week with a drive um, originating in Fort Collins. So that's going to do it for now. Remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. We'll see you again next week. Thanks again for watching, and take care.